Yep, we're rolling. All right. And this is for Johanna. And this, we're going to call this drones. And it'll say Johanna drones. And, I, and if I haven't sent you the link already, have your mom call me and I will send her the link. Okay? Now what we're going to do is we're going to drone first on the uh, third and fourth strings, putting our, our index finger. We're going to call these one, two, three, four, okay? And so I don't have to go index, middle, and do that stuff. So this is one, and it's going to be on the A note, which is kind of the equivalent of the second fret or your first tape on, and it's right on it. And then we're doing a D string open, or the third string open. And at the beginning of that song that we just heard, that soldier, then you just hear this forever. Which is a great exercise anyway because you can hear there's all different degrees of being in tune and out of tune. There's only one, you know, for me there's a spot that it sounds perfect to me and I know that sometimes is a little different for different people. And uh, but anyway, that sounds pretty in tune to me. Then we're gonna go. Our third finger in the left hand is gonna go up to the C, which is your. It's right at your tape, right? Is that your third tape? Yeah. So the first two would be. And then the C. That D is still droning. And then we're gonna switch to the middle two strings, and we're gonna. Let the second string drone or A string, second A string drone, and we're going to play um, D, F, which is right above your uh, first tape. So the individual notes are D, F, G, and with the drone A on top, it sounds like this. Then we're going to drone switch. We're going to play the same uh, positions with our uh, second and third fingers like we did on the F and G, but we're going to play it now on C and D on the second string and drone the string, the D string below that, the D or fourth, third string, uh, the D or third string below it. So we're switching from, an, from a drone that was above the notes that we were playing in the scale to a drone that's below the scale notes that we're playing. So it sounds Here's the two, um, the drone above it. And then the same bowing, the same bowing, the same two strings. So you can just go. second and first string and we're going to use the second string as the drone, the drone below again and we're going to have the scale notes on top and the scale notes are just below the first tape F, just above the first tap, tape uh, G and then at the um, then at the third tape which is the A. So the individual notes are F, G, A, and then with the drone A string on the bottom of that, droning the second string, playing the second and first strings together, it sounds like this. That's sometimes a good thing to do too. We don't want to put this E in the scale, but it all can help you hear the intonation.
want you to work on taking a little finger and putting it two half steps above that third tape and getting the unison between say the fourth and third string, the fourth string way up there and the third string open. Don't worry about it, it'll go ahead and slide it in like we were talking about and you'll hear that, vib feel that vibration in your you know, bones and stuff and you'll also get in your ears and you'll feel like in your chin. Close your eyes when you're doing it and it'll probably help. Then you can do it on the next pair of strings, the middle two using still the little finger. And then the top two pairs, top single pair, I should say, uh, first and second string. And this will, your little finger will be on the second string, and the first string will be open on this one. That's that real fiddleistic type of sound, and it's that exercise right there. If it hurts, don't worry about it. Just don't do it for too long, and shake your hand out, and give yourself a chance to rest. Is that good? All right. Hi, Cindy. All right. Let's close this. Yeah, yeah.